Uh, hi, Doug here at the MVP conference. I'm talking with uh, Jan Carl, who's an MVP Excel uh, from the Netherlands. Yes. So you had a longer plane flight than most, I would say. Yeah, say. ten and a half hours, something like that. <sighs> I don't want to go there. Uh, well, we're talking about Excel and 2010 and a new feature, um, uh, pivot slicers. Pivot slicers. The basic problem is that most customers don't seem to understand the filtering options in a pivot table. Okay. Um, you know, there's this nice drop down, they click it, and then, oh my gosh, what is this? They don't actually grasp what to do, it, what to do with it, especially if the data is hierarchical. Mm -hmm. You know, so if, if there are two filters, and one filter might um, affect the other one. But they don't see it because all elements stay in the other one. All the, or they have a long list in it. There's a long list and the list stays the same, even though the second list might have items that are irrelevant due to the filtering of the first list. Okay. So, pivot table slicers, a new element in Excel 2010. Yes. Um, thanks for coming from yeah, sure. Netherlands. John, John Carl from Excel MVP.